this out, John. God ain't gonna help you if you don't help yourself. Hey, you know that story about the man was stuck on the roof in the flood? He wouldn't get in the car when they came by. He said, God gonna save me. And he said, they let him go. And I got up to almost to the roof. And a man came by in a boat. And he said, that's okay. Y'all go ahead. God's gonna save me. God's gonna save me. And turn around. This man about to drown. And a helicopter have to come around. And he told him, okay, go ahead. God's gonna save you. He drowned. And when he got to heaven, and he came to the gate, he said, God, what happened? Why didn't you save me? He said, I sent you a car, I sent you a boat, and I sent you a helicopter, and I gave you grown and pigs, so why you ain't got no money? Okay. <laughs> gotta help yourself. Man. Don't expect nothing if you don't help yourself. And recognize when you got some help. Yes, sir. Grab your old man, y'all. All the time. We got to you. Yo, co-hosting on Grammy Picks, Dr. Cutting Hey, you know what? The sun may shine and it might snow in Las Vegas, but what's the odds on that? And what are the odds <laughs> of Grammy Picks having a special appearance by Dr. Cutting Stein? Welcome. <laughs> Welcome. Cutting Stein the house, y'all. Grammy Picks, baby, 2011, getting it in. That's yeah. right, y'all. It's a We're brand about new Raiders. year. Raiders! Boy, the Raiders, if y'all don't know Cut Stein's a Raider fan. Big Raider fan. And, uh, Raider Nation, yeah. uh, and give it up to my little, my little nephew, Sean. You know, every player on the Raiders, Sean, keep bossing them up, baby. Show them the heart of a lion. That's my little cut. That's my little nephew right there. Yeah, little nephew? He's a beast. Man, I tell you what, yeah. he a football fan now? Football fan. Wow. Y'all don't understand that. My life used to be a football player. I played a little football, but uh, that's my favorite sport. And uh, under my Christmas tree, it was a playoff birth. They said you can't be number one, but number two seed, baby. Hey, hey, hey. Crush, but shout out to the Raiders and all my Grammy family. But shout out to the Raiders for division, six, baby. six and zero. Oh. He proved it. I was wrong. I'm going to get into him now. You know, I'm going to give him some love. I'm kind of arguing with him and our double all season about. You win your old division and you go to the playoffs. Raiders. Why would it be the Raiders to prove me wrong, man? I got to eat it like that. But you know what I'm saying? It's a lot easier to swallow with a number two seed in the ALC playoffs. <laughs> That's right, baby. Keep it right. Keep it right. You know what I'm saying? You know, we here, man. So. We doing Grammy picks, man. 2011 on Grammy TV. Because we better than you, man. We keep it real. Well, I say we better than you. Way better. <laughs> yeah. And you know that. We've been saying it for years. Now, come on. Tell me what you excited about in these playoffs, man. We got Dr. Custard on the Grammy Big Show. Whoa, whoa, come man, on. Man, you know, check this out, y'all. I'm a non-gambler. I don't gamble on anything, man. That's just not my thing. Unless I might be involved in the actual sport. Now, you get me on the court, I might, you know, put a couple bucks on it. Okay. Well, let's say the bowling alley nowadays. <laughs> you know. All right, anyway. Get <laughs> up. Man, I'm really excited about this, man. It's gonna be some really good football, man. Some really good football. And like I say, I don't gamble, but I do watch the sport, and I know a lot well, about that's the what sport. I'm talking about, man. Tell me what game gonna get you all excited. Man. Okay, you know, now let me tell you what's going the on here. Give me the match. First of all, you know what? I know what's going on. Saturday, you got the uh, New York Jets flying into Indianapolis. Man, they going into Nick uh, Lucas Oil Field, okay. play football here. Okay. Now you got Rex Ryan, and okay. you know the Jets story, and, yeah. and yeah, of course you know that I picked the Jets to win the ALC to represent yeah. the ALC in the Super Bowl yeah. for the player Watch the Redskins. We're talking about that later. And uh, here they are in the playoffs. They got to go to a uh, big pavement, and uh, it's a three-point spread. Uh, uh, 
What do you think, man? Three points. Three points. Three points. Okay. Yeah. Now that's that's this is Vegas tight. respect. You gotta oh, realize, yeah, even though yeah, it yeah. snowed out here yesterday. Hey, man. We talking Vegas, y'all. Believe me, I watched every Grammy pick that's ever been. Every Grammy pick, man. I've watched them all. Yeah. Watched them all. So I've I've studied the art, the actual art of handicapping. Even though I'm not a handicapper, but I can tell you some surefire rules to this. And I was straight bet any of this. It's straight, straight bet, okay? Straight up. All right. I, um, I'm favorable to the Jets because, you know, they got Sanchez and, Sanchez and I'm just, you know, a California boy, man. What? <laughs> oh, wait a minute. So it's the USC connection? Man, I love I'm going to tell y'all something. I do love not it. have the, the knowledge in the college, but uh, the loyalty to uh, uh, to the college game yeah. and the college fans, y'all, you with, know what I'm saying? But, but, but I have to say. Be true to your city, baby. But you know what, though? Being true to your city, it's like this. When exactly your you guys can. are good, when you good on Saturday in college, exactly then I'm a then body. that's where money line gonna stuff his pockets when you come to the NFL, baby. I'll tell you, boy, because we only get the best in the NFL. That's right. The right? Best so of, the, the best of the best. And Miles Sanchez is what? The starting yeah. quarterback of the other um New York Jets. Jet. Let me tell you something real quick that you probably didn't know. What's that? I said that the most impressive win, somebody told me that they wasn't impressed with the Jets. They hadn't had an impressive win. And I told them I think they had an impressive win. And they asked me, well, what's that win? What was that win? I don't know who they beat. They Bird. beat the Steelers, man! Come on, <laughs> yeah. dude! Hey, but really, Anytime, though. No, wait a minute. It's yeah. not the fact that they beat the Steelers. Look how they did it. They did it on the road. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. And, 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 and uh. I, man, I'm going to tell you like look, this. It's it, a plus three, right? Just, just watch the trends, man. Freaking Peyton Manning coming back in the last two minutes of the game to barely win the game, all right? Now, another thing that I've heard Moneyline say, if you know that the game is crooked, why do you don't bet the crooked way? Cause you want to believe. It's always hope in the world. You know what I'm saying? Somebody is that one. Somebody always have hope. You know what I'm saying? Man. And, and, and keep you go real, man. Keep and, it real. And, 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 and I, I'm just saying. I'm just pocket. saying. I'm but just saying. It's about, it's about okay. stuffing your pockets. It's about stuffing your pockets. Real talk. So give it, We were talking so, about that. So okay. So let's go there for your pockets. And let's get a pick from man, the man that don't gamble. Uh, um, the Jets. Money line. If they give you the three, just straight bet it, man. Just straight bet it. Take the three. If you're gonna get a couple dollars on it, man, take that, man. Put a hundred on it. Put two hundred on it. The Jets gonna bring you back whatever change that is. That's okay. coming from a man we ain't put two dollars on that game. I'm telling you right now. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good advice. I'm telling you, it's a grimy old man, and I am too. So I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. Hmm. Jets taking off and look, oh, this is a tough one, y'all. I told you that I'm impressed with the Jets. Winning on the road, 6-1 on the road, 7-7. Seven, seven, uh, uh. They're going to beat Indianapolis. This is going to be the game that Indianapolis. Defense. Oh, this the, they done made it to the playoffs think, nine times in a row, and this is going to be the first time they get knocked out in the first round. I'm going with the cut. <laughs> we gotta take off with them jets, baby. And we're gonna take off for a moment. We're gonna come right back. Right Cause fixed. New York is the background. GTV. Vegas is the playground. You. That's what you hear in the black ground. Cause uh we way right down and grimy. Oh man. Yes, sir. Nappy New Year. We'll be right back.
go oh, all I can name 30 different folks. The best staff in television shows you every touchdown from every game. NFL Red Zone we love it. We love Money Line Back, the Grimy Pig Show. We'll Weekend all 2011 with our special we'll guest host, the Dr. Kutstein himself. <laughs> What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? You know what Dr. Kutstein in the house, man. Hey, I want to say what's up to all my grimy folks out there, man. God bless. Happy New Year to y'all. Hey, grimy kicks, y'all. We getting it in, man. I'm going to do it. What is this, the playoff show, man? It's the playoff show, baby. You know what I'm saying? I'm the of my Christmas tree. I got a playoff TC number two. Man, that's more good. Man, this is the playoff show. Dr. Kutstein right my here. My mom like the Lakers. Big up to big... To moms. Oh, we love the Lakers. Love the Lakers. And we love moms too. Thank you for all your support, yeah. all your kind love, and for giving the world the Dr. Kutstein. You know, probably Thanks, what it is. All my, my sister well, and my brother. Yeah, hey, I gotta get it in, man. I gotta you get it in. I got it on camera, man. Right. So I'm getting so it in. Don't, real don't forget, mom. And all, all the cell phones, stars, AC, and all. Uh, say, la, baby, Mr. Vegas World. Uh, yeah, my yeah, man, yeah, uh, Priest with Paul. R double A. Part of it from the beginning. Vegas. Wild, baby. Vegas. It snowed in Vegas. Yeah, man, it was cold, man. But, okay. You know, it ain't nothing, we, no. we already talked about what the Jets going if we flying in Jets. Because okay. uh, speaking of Jets, yeah. you know, in Vegas, we see Jets because we near Nellis Air Force Base. That's right. Okay, so we call the Long Jets time, coming man. in, coming in Indianapolis and dropping bombs on them yeah. with some defense, y'all. Watch yeah. that yeah. under. Yeah. But, yeah, watch uh, this. Watch, uh, watch uh, that. Uh, that, that same day, we got another game that uh, we need to talk about, and uh, that's going to be an NFC. Okay. And uh, that will be the, uh, wait a minute now, I got backed up. Uh-oh. And uh, the winner of that game. Okay. The winner of the game between the Jets and the Colts. The Jets is going to We play did mention get a shot to go to Pittsburgh. The Jets and, is uh, going to play Pittsburgh. The Jets going to play Pittsburgh. <laughs> in Pittsburgh. I love that because the Jets already... Be Pittsburgh in Pittsburgh. Okay, go do it again. Hey, got him up. No, <laughs> man. By the time you leave Pittsburgh with your foot up in there behind like you man. did and came back, when you get back, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, when bro. you out of fuel. Okay, what about, did Paul Mala play in the first game? No. Okay. It's oh, game. I'm going to tell y'all something. I'm show y'all how grimy on me is. Now, if you go back and do your research and find out that, it was a rumor that Palomano would not play in the game against the uh, Browns. Yeah, they smell kind of brown in that game anyway. Yeah. But uh, yeah, they, they said them. that uh, Palomano was going to play. And I thought I was the only one in Vegas that was like... What was the line on that, man? The line on that game? That Cleveland game, yeah. Cleveland game was... Uh, it was... Because uh, I know it was scoring like a billion to two, man. Shit. What? You know, they still adding up the score right now. <laughs> <laughs> they still calculate what the actual score yeah, was at the end of that amazing. game. You know, that's why Pittsburgh got a week off because right. they still got to add that, that yeah, up. Stats, but, uh, you know, y'all already know the story. This is more time meeting than it is out there, but you come to Grammy yes, Picks yes, to get the inside Vegas information. Man. And Dr. Custine is on the Grammy Picks show. So check this out. Get it in, baby. Yeah, uh, the, uh, the, the, let's take it to the full and stay in the AFC. Okay. Okay. So, so we say that the Jets go ahead and handle their business yep. in, in, in Naples. Yes, sir. They come back, back to Pittsburgh and uh -huh. face the Steelers. Now, that game will be probably Pittsburgh. A minus three. It's the playoffs, y'all. They're going to put keep the games okay. tight, numbers tight. So, three and a half. You know okay, what I'm saying? Okay. Then they'll let the public Can we, All right, all right, all right. right. You, you're going way too far from no, it. Let's no, move that's, on. That's, let's do, let's stay, let's stay with the wild card game. No, because we go on to the Super Bowl. Let's okay. stay in the AFC. Okay. It's the wild card game. Let's okay. stay in the AFC. Okay, go ahead. It's the playoff show. Okay. With a special guest. So, all right, so you want me to Cause you know, I'm gonna walk, take you walk to the, it up? I'm going to take you, yeah, I want you to up. walk it all the way up. Then we'll come back and do the all NFC right, on right. the other side. Palomar playing in the game with the Jets. 
minus three. When we talking about stuff in your pocket. Palomano is seven point nine or more. He's the difference between uh, this bro scoring seventeen points and twenty seven points. All right, so. You figure in that case, man, ain't nobody beating Pittsburgh at home in that game. I don't think so. Jets. Okay, so therefore, yeah, I, don't I agree. And I'm listening, boy. I agree. And you got you got, got pick going up. And I agree that of course, um, of course. yes, Pittsburgh win this game against the Jets. We have a great history against the Jets, uh, uh, and especially in the playoffs. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, given that, yeah, Pittsburgh. Uh, 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 defending the, uh, the, the, the divisional round game against the Jets. Okay. Therefore, okay, in the other game, you have Baltimore going to Kansas City. Baltimore Ravens going to Kansas City. Man, Baltimore gonna spank that ass, man. I don't give a fuck what the spread is. Dr. Cutting Stein has said what? Spanking that ass. Baltimore spanking it in Kansas City? Like 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 blackbirds falling out of the sky in Arkansas. Oh like uh uh, uh I'm OG yo uh, oh like uh 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 Alfred Hitchcock with the birds <laughs> Sir Oh <Yeah>. my goodness <laughs> Oh my goodness This Black is birds. This is prophetic Black birds. This is kinda talk <laughs> I mean No for real You you saying that they going to Kansas City. Man. Right. And just here I right. Kansas City. Like right. 2,000 strong. But no, real talk, man. Ray, your boy. Ray, Ray Allen. Allen. Oh, oh. Ray Allen. I mean, Ray Allen. I, I, I hate to, the Celtics, man, but uh, okay, I we said talk Ray Allen. They, they, you talking about Ray Lewis. Sugar Ray Lewis. <laughs> We're talking Sugar Ray. So you believe in, in Ray Lewis, that him and Ed Reed and that ball hawking uh, defense can go into Arrowhead Stadium, right? And spank them. Yeah. And spank them. Yeah. Is there a line on that already? Yes, there is a line on that. And Baltimore is getting... Don't let me, don't let me get this wrong. Okay. Hold on. But yeah, real talk, y'all. Go to the, hold on, just a second. We'll go to the Ray Grammy Lewis. on information, information thing. Yeah, he's talking to him, cut. Talk to him while I get the information. But here goes some more information. All right. Your boy taught all those other linebackers how to play football and all those other linemen how to play football. I mean, just like playing with Jordan. You know what I'm saying? You think Pippen was, if you practice with Jordan every day, you're gonna, your game's going to get better. Okay? <laughs> The best with the best. The best of the best, huh? Man, okay. you practicing with Kobe, I was confirmed. You get that, 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 the total is 41, and then, uh, the Baltimore is, is at minus three on the road against Kansas City. They give Kansas City three points. Taking the under, <laughs> definitely. You're taking the under, definitely. Okay, I'm going to go with you on that, Custom. We saying in AFC uh, uh, wild card playoff that the uh, Baltimore State. Oh, Ravens and the uh, Kansas City Chiefs will go under a total of 41. Yeah, yeah. Nah, I you know. out there by yourself on that one. I'll okay. tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to take that game. I'm going to take those three points. Okay, straight bet it. I'm going to take those three points. Hey, he's straight a bad better better. I'm going to take those three points. He's a better better. In Arrowhead Stadium where I have Jets, not planes from McCarran International. I'm talking about Jets. Uh -huh. From uh 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 uh, well, flying over, and that's how that that stadium sounds. Okay, and then they got the players right there on that uh, game right uh, there. I don't gamble. We are, that's already been confirmed. Okay, however, if I was gonna put any money on that game right there, I don't give a fuck. The Ravens are gonna win.